circulatory disorders. So with reference to circulatory disorders, we have a few disorders. We will start with hypertension. Increased blood pressure is called as hypertension. Blood pressure. Now, when there is a blood vessel, when the blood is flowing through the blood vessel, when the blood is flowing through the blood vessel, I mean the artery. We have got blood, blood vessels includes arteries, veins. We are taking the pressure inside the arteries, not the veins. All right. Now, when the blood is flowing inside the artery, this blood exerts some lateral pressure on the wall of the artery. Lateral pressure on the wall of artery. It is called as blood pressure. And normal blood pressure is 120 by 80. 120 millimeters of mercury divided by 80 millimeters of mercury. The 120 millimeters of mercury is called as systolic blood pressure. Systole, contraction. Um, when heart has underwent contraction, at the time of contraction, See, heart has underwent contraction. Blood is flowing. So when the blood is flowing through arteries, at the time of systole, it exerts some pressure. It is called as systolic blood pressure. So blood pressure that is calculated in the walls of arteries at the time of systole of heart. It is around 120 millimeters of mercury. Diastolic blood pressure. Diastolic blood pressure means the heart is in relaxed state. When, when it is in relaxed state, still some blood is flowing through the arteries and whichever pressure it exerts on the wall of uh, arteries, when the heart is in relaxed state, it is called as diastolic blood pressure. Now the blood pressure varies with age. 